Did you watch much of Stanford before Coach Mason got there? No, I, I did not. So you never kind of seen what I – mean, he kind of built his reputation on that, with that Stanford defense. Is, oh, yeah. No, no, I mean, of course you heard about Stanford and everything just, just because how successful they were. But uh, I'm, I'm glad the, uh, that he's bringing that defense over here because just because of the success that they have, I feel as if, you know, they can be successful in the Pac-12 and do what they do to, like, you know, big-time offenses like Oregon, you know, that would be uh, beneficial to us bringing that over here. What did you do when you found out that he was going to be your coach? I imagine you had to do some sort of research. Did you? Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely look, look him up and everything like that. But uh, when they all got here and they brought the staff in, they, they got us all, like, iPads. Like, we, our team had not had iPads before. So, they, you know, they pushed the film out to Stanford so we can watch it. And uh, it's been real beneficial to us learning the new defense. You guys had a really experienced secondary last year and Pretty much mm. all gone. So, I mean, how, what, what do you see your role as in, you know, kind of making up for those losses and kind of filling in those spaces? Uh, yeah, we lost we lost uh, a few guys, uh, Andre Howe, uh, Kenny Ladler, Devon Marshall, Steve Clark, you know, real, real great players for Vanderbilt. But I feel as if, you know, the young guys that we have, uh, they have a lot of talent, a lot of talent. And I feel as if we have a lot of depth as well, guys that can come in and play if they need to play. So, uh, in that respect, I feel real positive about um, our secondary. Andrew, Coach Mason up there kind of characterized you guys as a bunch of no-name guys that have a chance to, to do some great things. Yeah. Do you kind of agree with that? Has he been selling that a lot to you guys this offseason? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Um, then again, it all comes down to just like working hard and putting in that work in order to reap the benefits of success. And uh, I feel as if his major point is just like working hard and you know keeping that that mindset that we are going to be successful and that, that we are going to win championships. Do you feel like you guys are kind of a no-name group that you know you won nine games last year? Uh, 